Hi, I'm Jason. Welcome to the final video in this series describing how to make a knife handle. Continue to use the diamond file until the deep scratches left by the large wood file are gone. I noticed that one scale was protruding further from the other, so I evened it out using a wood file and then resanding through 12,000 grit micro mess. With the bolsters evened out, it's time to shape them and the handle edges. I start the shape with a small wood file, but will switch to a large one once the angle I want is achieved. Use the large wood file for the edges. Here's the result. I now have a nicely defined edge that I will f follow when hand sanding. Here I'm showing how I use the file to obtain the edges. It's a rather boring process, so you get the picture. Now it's time to sand. This can take a while. Start with 100 grit if needed. I started with 220 grit, moved to 320, then 400 and switched to micro mesh through 12,000 grit. From there, I evaluated the deep scratches still remaining in the blade, focused on them using 220 grit, and did the process all over again, giving the blade edging a nice mirror edge. This is the result. Now it's time to add a stain. I used Danish oil at first, but it wasn't rich enough, so I applied two coats of classic American stain later. Clean the blade up with acetone and tape it up. This will protect the blade while I use the bill buffing system on my mini lathe to polish the steel and the handle. On the bill buffing system, start with Tripoli, then use white diamond and finish with carnauba wax.
you will need to hand buff the canuba wax at the end of the process. Here's what it looks like when completed. Now it's time to etch the blade using furic nitrate. I use a Q-tip to apply the chemical and let it sit for several minutes before neutralizing it with vinegar. A final touch up on the top of the file work to make it stand out and match the rest of the blade using 400 grit sandpaper and we're ready to wax the blade. I'm using metal oil. Apply with a shop towel, buff, and let cure 12 hours, then repeat. Clean the blade with acetone before using as a hunting knife and reapply the oil after hunting season to protect the blade while it's in storage. I hope you enjoyed watching this series. Thanks for watching and good luck with your knife.